Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this quick video, I would like to show you how you can easily compare files uh, in OneDrive for Business uh, using Copilot. Uh, in my opinion, this is you know one of the most you know powerful you know Copilot capabilities when you have uh, several files, especially if they're you know large documents, might not be familiar with. Uh, there is a very, very easy way for you to compare uh, multiple documents at once. Let me show you the trick. So here I am in OneDrive for Business, and of course, this is where I store all my private documents, right? This is not a SharePoint document library. And um, I have the several policies over here, all right? And I would like to compare them. I would like, you know, to compare them. I mean, they're kind of, you know, kind of the same, right? Some of them is kind of the same. Um, I really don't know what the difference is. I, I would like to find out. So here's what you need to do. So you click uh, on a document and I want to compare it to, you know, this one, for example. And under Copilot, all right, drop down, you are going to see compare files option. By the way, you can select multiple documents. The limit is five though, all right? That's very important. You cannot compare more than five documents. So if I select three documents, even four documents, I can still, you know, compare. But the minute I go above, you know, so five, six right here, you see uh, it disappeared on me. So uh, a maximum of five documents can be compared. So yeah, let's do this three only. Again, Copilot, compare files, and that's pretty much it. What, what's going to happen, it usually creates this uh, nice table, you know, kind of output. Here it is. And yeah, it just extracts the information, tries to organize it in some sort of table. So here are the three policies and different, I guess, categories, sections, and, you know, uh, it tells me what um, each uh, document is saying about each particular aspect, I guess, all right? Uh, first of all, uh, I can copy this information. Maybe I want to paste it and read it later somewhere, or I can also ask um, a follow-up questions, or, uh, you know, and uh, whatever they are. Uh, yeah, let's just, you know, choose one of these uh, built-in questions, but you can obviously ask any questions yeah, you wish. All right, here we go. Now, let me cover something else. Um, Obviously, when I started this video, I, um, you know, I said that I'm in OneDrive for Business, and there is a reason for that. If I go to SharePoint, and again, this is actually where the, the, the those policies, you know, also reside. But um, the problem is, the problem is, as of the recording of this video, there is no way to essentially execute the same command to summarize files using Copilot. Uh, using the fun functionality I just showed you. So if I, you know, for example, select a few files and I try to, uh, you know, com you know, ca you know, compare them or ask a question, uh, those capabilities are not there. There is no Copilot dropdown. And um, not sure if this capability will be added here, but uh, at the moment it's not there. All right. So uh, let me show you the workaround. Let me show you the workaround. So go back to OneDrive for Business, and on the left-hand side, under Quick Access, you will see the sites you append to Quick Access or the ones you visit on a regular basis. And this policies library that I just you know, uh, showed you happens to be one of them. So when you click on it, very important, you are going to see um, essentially the, you know, the library the SharePoint document library from within OneDrive. So again, that's the same library you see over here. I'm just displaying, you just actually view it from OneDrive, you know, for business. And look at this, I can now, oh, once again, you know, I think it was this, so it doesn't really matter, all right? You can now select multiple documents and look at this. You can um, essentially, uh, you know, compare them. So you can use this feature on SharePoint document libraries. The trick is you need to view those libraries from OneDrive for business. That's pretty much the the trick. Um, but yeah, here it is. And uh, look, uh, I mean, that's all there is to it. Nice and easy, in my opinion, super powerful feature. If you are, you know, maybe trying to compare a few documents, you know, especially very large documents, you don't want to you know, manually read through them and, you know, try to compare, um, you know, Copilot will do it for you.
All right. So that's all uh, once again for this uh, particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my uh, blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Goodbye.